Every February, the country celebrates the achievements and history of African Americans as part of Black History Month. But there is a place in downtown Nashville where all the facts are at your fingertips all year. News Channel 5's Aaron Cantrell takes us on a history lesson into the civil rights room. All children got a it wasn't long ago when black people were considered less than their white counterparts in the eyes of the law. This is 60 years ago, a little over 60 years ago. So some of these folks are still with us. Around the 1950s and 60s, some people had enough. They wanted black Americans to have equal rights under the law, which sparked the civil rights movement. You know, imagine being able to go and buy merchandise, but not being allowed to use the restrooms or not being allowed to sit at the lunch counter and have a meal just like any other paying customer in the same store. The masses know about Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., maybe even Thurgood Marshall. But what about the Nashville college students who peacefully protested for equal rights? history on display at the Nashville Public Library in downtown Nashville. The Civil Rights Room overlooks the intersection of 7th and Church Street, which is where I'm standing at, and this is where nonviolent protests took place during the Civil Rights Movement. The students left First Baptist Church Capitol Hill, which used to be right behind the Tennessee Tower, right around the corner here, and they marched right past this site where we are right now on their way to Fifth Avenue. Where, they, to, where the stores they were going to. This symbolic lunch counter inside examines a timeline of local and national events of the movement. Also, the 10 rules of conduct for protesters to follow. Can't imagine being that disciplined and focused and courageous at 19 years old. The truth behind segregation and racism will have you consumed with a lot of emotions. There might be some anger, there might be some disappointment, you know, but there will probably uh, also be some pride, you know, and maybe even some joy uh, to, to think about the things that went down right, right here in this city, right where we are. Elliot Robinson, the library's program specialist, believes if you don't know your past, you are doomed to repeat it. There's Black History Month in here all the time. In Nashville, Aaron Cantrell, News Channel 5. Thank you, Aaron. The Civil Rights Room is a permanent exhibit, so be sure to check it out. It's on the downtown library's second floor.